And all new at six, a former Miramar police officer makes a deal in court and pleads guilty to a first degree felony. Good evening, I'm Elliot Rodriguez. And I'm Lauren Pastrana. The plea agreement comes after the former officer was accused of having sex with an underage girl. CBS News Miami's Anna McAllister has been following the story and joins us from criminal court in downtown Miami. Anna? Well, Lauren Elliott, 30 year old Jose Hernandez will never wear a badge again. That's part of the deal that he struck with prosecutors. And although he pleaded guilty to a first degree felony, he will not serve any jail time and he does not have to register as a sex offender. Are you pleading guilty because you are guilty? Yes, sir. A man who once served the community cops a plea deal. Today, 30 year old Jose Hernandez, a former Miramar police officer, pled guilty to a first degree felony of aggravated child abuse. You will not go to trial, you will not have an attorney, you will not have a right to appeal. You understand that? Yes, sir. Last year, Hernandez was arrested and accused of having sex with a 17 year old girl he met on Tinder who lied about her age, saying she was 23 years old. The amended charge is a more serious offense than his original charges of unlawful sexual activity with a minor and contributing to the delinquency of a minor. By changing the charge to aggravated child abuse, you avoid the registration requirement. Aggravated child abuse does not carry a mandatory uh, sex offender registration. Maria Schneider, a former prosecutor, says the fact that the minor lied about her age could have been taken into consideration by the state. The fact that the uh, minor uh, misrepresent her age is not technically a defense. However, it is a mitigating factor. Prosecutors are allowed to take factors such as those into account in deciding what is just, what is most in the interest of justice. Hernandez was sentenced to 10 years probation and must surrender all of his criminal justice certifications. According to the plea agreement, Hernandez must also complete a mentally disordered sexual offender treatment program. If for any reason he's terminated from the program, he'll be brought to court for violating probation. We tried to speak to Hernandez as he left court today, but he had no comment. And Hernandez is not allowed to work with minors, and he cannot enter a profession that requires him to wear a uniform of any kind. But for now, reporting from criminal court in Miami, Adam McAllister, CBS News, Miami.